Tia papa dona de lo wala pare ganyambo TPT. Kajin bale nyanyi nyambo yado aji mara ya pa nyunu kolo lango. Ngula jul ringi manda Central Land Council Mano Wet Project Officers. Please hiri hiri lili nyanga nyambo yado aji mara ya pa nyunu pato kolo lango. Ngula jok. I was up in Lodge Manor, happened to be a Walpuri uh, triangle meeting going on, and someone said, these ladies would like to talk to you. Anyway, I went over and said hello, and uh, they wanted to talk about how can they use real money for education. The opportunity came up a couple of years after. Uh, after that, for renegotiation of the mines in the in the Tanami. Newmont negotiated with traditional owners through the land council that uh, we would pay an extra royalty uh, from the mine, on the condition that that extra money went to uh, what was a new organisation that to be set up specifically for education and training. So it's an extra half percent royalty that we pay specifically for wet. So was born uh, the Walpuri Education Training Trust. Newmont Mining Company. Kalu pangan jalan buka all way pi mani. Mula jangan kalu royal degree era ni. Panokar jem mani. Panokar jem kalu era ni wet program kira. Kora wet sub kemeri le kalu kalu jem mani sur mat mani. An kalu ni na in charge. Kalu 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 sur mat ban mani jangan wet ikalang ojo. Jo ayah kalu kalu kora angul jangan bayar nungan aje. Sales si ingul langga ayah kalu wet ikalang om. Mana itu logo ada mana orang kurung orang pelu, ngolanya. Jera mak ojo apa lagi nak nyer pejangga. Jera mak ay, jera pejangga. Jera mak lajak mana orang, jera mak bola orang, ngolanya kalau. Walau berapa tu kalau ngocaro wet sub kemeri, nyena, kalau muka wet. Walau berapa tu kalau ngocaro wet sub kemeri, kalau jana. CLC jangga, konsultan orang ka, ingol jana orang ka, kalau muka walau berapa kalau ngoko. Kerja yang kalau mungkin community CLC orang batal mah mana yang boleh apa batu yang boleh beri batu kelang ujaru wet sub kemeri kalau jenda jarang mana kalau wangka yang orang meeting lah wangka me nak bangun kalau jem money jalan boleh beri batu kelang kemeri yang spendi money CLC mana boleh beri batu kelang ujaru wet sub kemeri mula kalau jangan ni ngaca yang orang jangan kalau kui wangka wet advisory kemeri Mula jangan kal jangan ni, yang kal jangan bayar ni langka, kura, kura wet sub kemeri, miring jangan lah, kau jual miring lah, wek kal jangan tunggu ni mana. Elem four bola, kau jual elem cendera jalan mana, miring jangan lah. Mula kal desa ada langka, nara bola kal jangan elem four world pre kemeri class, spendi mana mana. Elu wek kal jangan langka world fish ni, yang kal nara bola tunggu ni mana, early childhood ok, umur awi. When we started, we did quite broad-based consultations in the communities, and um, different communities wanted different things, but all the communities wanted some more playgroups, and now we've got playgroups running in all the communities. There's 28 people taking part in training, so training has been a really important part of what we've done. Yeah, I'm going to training, and then brother, I'm going to do my name. Jal ke ambla training kita nak tu menangga course angga school biar aja lah. The training has been a great experience because the trainers come to childcare. They come to childcare for one week out of every five. So at the end of last year we had a graduation and ten staff passed either the certificate one or certificate one and two in childcare. And now this year they're all starting on Certificate 3 in childcare. With the help from Wet Money and from World Vision to find in the trainers, to West Australian Tape who come out and do the training with us. We were excited to go to Perth trip 
first time I went on a plane. We went to Western Australia Deaf College for over one week and we were all training, study, and all of our kids went to childcare. We visited to childcare center. It's good because give you understanding and more ideas about how to run your play group and well we learn from them and they learn from us. Yeah, we get to ask questions and they tell us information about their child's child care center. We're gonna use that idea as soon as we get a crash. There's been changes here, like they have new things for the kids and better toys for kids to play with. Uh, we just get the kids to come in the morning and we bath them and then we get them to play with toys and then they, some kids that get to play outside if they feel like it and then uh, one of the staffs get to look after the kids while uh, me, myself or someone do the cooking for the lunch. Well, like, it's important for the little ones to come to the... for parents to bring them to crash because that they will learn more new things and words that they would get ready for school. She was going to the play group. Until when she turned four, well then preschool got start. She's gone to preschool now. Would have been pretty hard too when, when if there was no play group. Well, so I do a full time job in the, for the council and for the community. We have a little area for play group, a blue container for all the toys to be put in. It's running really good. I'm just start up this year. Three staff, Yapa staff, and one career staff. And also I to um, talk around the community, asking mothers, fathers, or grandparents, you know, how they feel about play group. And a lot of mothers come to their children. Sometimes fathers come to, they sit in a park in the side, watching their little ones. So the SNAKE conference is a, a peak conference for the Secretariat of the National Aboriginal and, and Islander Childcare um, Association and the four commu Walpuri communities um, last year went um, there and were really central to the conference. And when they came to the WET um, seminar, they could see the hope that Walpuri people have for the future and what they're doing themselves. And people really loved that. And they came away saying that they were going home from the conference happy in spirit because of the, what they'd heard from Walpuri people. School Lang Lagalana. Support money, secondary support, elder payment, and country visit loan. Support Kuruguru Ganga Umragan Al Janaini. Wherever they want to go, excursion, like for example, Melbourne Gora Liano, Indian Ganal Janet. Kuruguru just gonna get educated, gonna get excursion, a young Liano Wundro. Yeah, it was just two weeks um, of just full-on activities and most of the activities that we did, I'd say that the kids had never done before. Um, we did some amazing things, you know, we, they went kayaking, they went surfing, they went ice skating, they went horse riding, they went up tall buildings on trains and trams and round to really special places. Um, it was just an amazing experience and... To see the kids in in that different environment um, it was just it was terrific. First time I'm going to sit here and I'm going to go there and I'll park there. I'm going to go there and I'm going to go there and so I'm going to go there and I'm going to go there.
Last year, for example, students went to Falls Creek and a few other places where there was a lot of snow last year, and something that the school couldn't do if it wasn't for wet. Like 18 students, one week, one two, three days, Falls Creek, and two days, Melbourne. So we worked a lot on their oral English before we left on the trip. A lot of them started off at the beginning of the trip where their head would be down and um, they would mumble a lot. Like even if they were just ordering food or, or asking questions, but then you kind of see them by the end of the trip with their head held high and they're confidently um, ordering things or, or whatever, using their English skills. I was scared of contests. <laughs> and when, when was scary. got up really early, went to um, four school. Played with snow, we made um, snowballs. Snowballs, snowmans. We got slides and everything. We didn't see snow before. It was first time. I wish I could go again. <laughs> it's really fun. Some people like to come to school and get get to go to trips, and they they tell their big brothers or sisters to come to school so they can go to trips and all and learn. Um, yes, it was something that we organised throughout the year thanks to the money available from WET for the high school students to access. We based it on attendance last year to try and use it as an incentive for students to another way for them to want to come to school every day. And we spent eight days staying in Melbourne in St Kilda and we had a whole lot of educational activities and fun activities as well. Did a tour of the MCG in the National Sports Museum. Met the Melbourne Football Club and we're trying to develop a relationship with them and their reading program that they do so that students got to meet some of the Melbourne players and kick the footy and get autographs. And then we visited uh, Glen Waverley high school so the students here got to play some soccer with some students in Melbourne and sort of have a bit of an intercultural sort of getting to know each other and have a bit of fun. No one got any museum and any aquarium but I'm got look and then and then share they teach these young people culture and they learn about traditional things out in the bush with old people and elders. We a team like Napa team this time. Like Pirani. We are going to be a woman. 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 We are going to be Yeah. <laughs> Really important for us, Sanganaji. Culture, school, language, language, 
A lot of what we've been doing this term in literacy, English literacy, the topics are coming from things we did out on country and it's just that real world thing which I think is really important. It's about, for all students growing up in high school especially, it's about learning who you are and your place in the world and I don't think that can be authentically done without altering the classroom. <laughs> Mantia program mano PIW in Lenarbang with the Uchiman Youth and Media Program. The program had originally started in Yunamu and at Mount Theo Outstation, but now with the help of WET, we've managed to start working in Nirupi and Lajamanu and Walara as well. So um, as part of that, the Mount Theo program changed its name to Walpuri Youth Development Aboriginal Corporation to show that we're actually working with Walpuri youth across the whole region, which is something we're really proud of. Well, the youth program has been working for a couple of years now, and it's a good run time. A lot of young people are getting involved now. Come back to the young people, you know, young people, but now they're getting into it like. And some young girls, to youth programs, a lot of activities. I assist um, youth full time youth workers. Just helping them out to activities. Sometimes they don't know what to do. Quiet on set. Wrong camera. Action. Um, we're making a movie about school and telling all the kids not to go to school because it's too boring. School. Ha, 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 ha.
Media training is like doing video editing and doing you know, video flicks and all that. I know that movie, and uh, it's like coming up really good. You know, you can see clips and good young people. And that shows that shows that young people are keen to learn and they're learning more and getting more experience. You know? and, Jadi di tengah waktu kita itu mulai 2008. Alat itu benda peraya mau turun dek peraya tu. Enam hotel pun. We run a youth diversionary program in each community with a focus on media. The the diversion side is the sport and rec activities, arts and craft. Um, and for the media, we have media trainers like Anna Cadden who come out and actually run different sort of media workshops. We also have PAW who come out and do different sort of workshops with um, animation and video. So for those 16 years and older, more challenging activities that aren't just about keeping them excited or interested, it's about maybe developing a career pathway leadership and employment. I think it started as a like, fun project, then came serious and done it with other two communities, with Nidbe and Wulara. And we got invited from Sydney Animation Festival to go there. I think my training was good. Had a lot of support. And I'm now working, working at PAW and helping out other young people do the same. Youth Karakana and Youth Canal Bani Mana Kurukot Kul Play the Agal Kurukot Help Mangal and a Kurukoro Madan Ganal and a Kanyan and a push trip Swimming Ganal and a Kanyan. Kanda kana kana jana kan kanda kana wudara men orang kanyi kala jana nyanyi orang kini mula yang men orang wira wira push trip nak tu mana pun kana kana jana bulan kana kana jana firia man kuro kuro ya wujud kanda kana kana jana kanga all people lang young girls ngajung kana jana firia man and mula jana bini orang kala jana help man ngenai man jaga and Sharon, kalau jelah pun, ini mana? Karena rula ring cinta ngan tu, mana mampu ring change in change. Mari jangan. Kita kalau ada jemput orang apa? Kalau dia berdua, dia berdua, kalau 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 dia Oh iya, mana yang akan nak bangun lewat luar kerja akan lulat nak bangun lagi. Nyamat. Mutu ada tu menjaga ambut media sendak lagi. Kuda kuda langgar pun jaga family. Walau macam ni orang raw lambat lagi zaman lalu. Council advice ah, ngan ek. Ya boleh aku jaga nawang kan? Oyer pun ngan ya pakai langu. Ya le na ya le pending record la kalas dia lan. Yang kiri deh. Pending itu mana huge buat kalau. Rekod lah langgan yang ka, ya paklang lah tu. Season, cendera juga mana we yang ada, cendera jo, cendera kalau pakai dia ya kerap ram, cendera kalau juga bar ram, cendera juga mata jalan melke. Kau kan tu pilih kerana rekod of story orang lang, or people lah, ini lah. Jom am come back work with young people lah. After doing training, we found a job, and we work on the shire. We know that the youth programs, in terms of the basic diversionary activities, are happening and they're keeping the kids happy. But now we're really starting to challenge those 16 to 25 year olds in particular for them to become the next generation of leaders in the Warpree communities. I'm really proud for young people, you know, 
making these movies and video editing kongul duman ngurtnya nanga i'm just makes me really proud i'm gonna keep on playing but there's no gamma music learning center gor alkum support room mananga clc shaya and batchela thank you very much for inviting us here today for this very exciting launch of the learning community center in nirpi and yanu kadewari la sia opuni mandak and you mandoring la non clc ngane chepes and yanu and tunga warin jaja la ng all on elders kuru kuru ngane pat por kanda por warin jaja la mutyungul mananga am ngane sari sanda nirpi nga the Walbury Training Trust was aware that Bachelor had a facility there in the community and so we started a dialogue looking at how we might be able to partner to meet the need that the Nirupi community had identified for more education and training. FM and Cheryl, who were there at Nirupi, they do their own delivery of literacy, numeracy, life skill training, but they also broker in a lot of training. The funding though from uh, Walpree Education and Training Trust is critically important because it gives this place an enormous degree of flexibility. So they don't just deliver their own areas, they do this coordinating, brokering in a range of training that is in response to what people are looking to be involved in. Old people are learning, you know, maybe age like 60s or 70s, 50s. Yeah, they are learning, they are learning, they are learning, they are learning, and name, they are learning, 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 just about everybody in Nirupi comes comes through the door, you know, every week or so. Yeah, I think it's a model that's really exciting and it's opened up all sorts of possibilities for Bachelor through the, the support of Walby Training Trust. So it's a partnership that we're really excited about. It's a partnership that we're really proud of and uh, I can just see it going from strength to strength. Hopefully uh, we're uh, just one or two steps away from getting the, uh, the Wallara Learning Centre up and running. Um, that's been a long-winded process. What are the long the learning centre? Might be for six, six or seven years now. And two good the learning centre. And it's good news for the Mangaranjan. Land camps, as a partner. Through by wet now, language funding and payment of language. Come for a number to training center, training room, computer. Then go to training and internet. Internet banking, everything that you do, computer, number one, number one. Yeah, work funding, you know. And it's good, good to know. Learning as an adult, um, use the Facebook and internet banking. It's a public internet room for everybody. What is the future for our kids? where people can publish, record, make DVDs in Wadbury for generation after generation can know that those things are there. We're going to keep this program running and, and a lot of good things have come out in the past few years, you know, and it's coming really good. It is working really well and we are proud of it because we make things happen. Yep.
this year 2011 we're doing what video this year we're doing it well I don't know remember I'll work well you'll be on my go what's all about yeah more more help number to your web video we're on the other one that web on a video and all the web project the more I took what's all about and learn more again more training yeah it's good um, what helping us for training and keeping us funding more funding